Hi, this is Monty from Moat Park Vehicles and here's another one of our detailed vehicle appraisals on a car that's just recently come into us. This is our limited edition Smart 4.2 Urban Style. Uh, from memory, and I did work for Mercedes-Benz for an awful long time, from memory I think they only made this car in 2010 as this particular car is. Uh, covered just over 51,000 miles but in this unique uh, matte grey, it's not wrapped, but it's in a unique matte grey with unique matte grey alloy wheels. No one's done this, this is all done at the Mercedes-Benz factory or the Smart factory. So I'm gonna briefly walk around the car and give you a more detailed view very shortly. So, as I mentioned, she's covered just over 51,000 miles. I will advertise it with 50,000 miles, but put the actual mileage in there, just so it's in that catchment, just in case someone was looking for a car and wanted only to go up to 50,000 miles, we will put the actual mileage down of the vehicle. All right, now these, even though they're matte gray, the Tridian safety cell, which is the black bit, uh, they normally go by that for the color of the car. We won't advertise it as black, we'll advertise it as matte gray. Okay, now the reasons we tend to do these videos, it's all about trust, honesty, integrity. We try and tell you how it is. Now, I am only human. Uh, I don't intentionally go out to mislead anybody to come all this way, whether they're two miles down the road or 200 miles away, to come and have a look at a car. So I have, if I have missed anything, it's not intentional. Uh, as I mentioned, I am only human. Please read some of my reviews on Auto Trader. They're all genuine reviews. Nothing's made up. they were verified purchases, etc. Now, um, what I was mentioning to you about the car itself, uh, in terms of service history, we've got from memory, I think it's about six services that have been carried out on this particular car. Uh, a lot of the times, customers don't generally service them every year. Um, they'll look at buying the go by the mileage. But what we're going to do to the car, which should always be done every every couple of years really, is changing the micro hybrid drive belt. Nothing, it's not like a timing belt or anything like that. It's how the stop start works. Works off the alternator. If you know anything about these cars, give us a call, uh, and we'll tell you what we're changing. It's quite a simple belt from Mercedes Benz. They're only about 15 quid, and we'll get them done. But they must be done. Now, if you're looking at another smart car of this sort of age or any MHD, micro hybrid drive, ask the garage, have they changed the belt for you? They, they really should be changed every two years, I think it was a Mercedes, uh, but they now change it recently to every year. Okay, so let's try and uh, zoom in and try and show you everything on the car. Now, I think the majority of customers realizing now they're gonna be looking at a car that's gonna be 10 years of age. Uh, it's gonna have a few little marks here and there, hence the reason why we tend to do these videos. Um, a lot of garages have started doing these videos now. Run around the car, 30 seconds or so. Don't really give you a good view inside or anything that's on the vehicle. Now I'm gonna point out a couple of bits and pieces that are on the car, and I'll do that very, very shortly. Let me just show you inside. So, you go back here. So privacy glass all the way around. You've got panoramic glass roof for this car. Air conditioning works absolutely fine. Again, when you're looking at these cars, make sure the air conditioning works. Okay, they are quite prone to not working. And also our warranty also covers uh, any kind of failures to do with air conditioning. So, you've got leather interior in here. You could say it's half leather, but it majority of sort of like, you know, 75% of it's leather, but you've got this slightly different gray kind of velour velvet touch to the uh, seats and you've got this really nice yellow stitching that goes around all the leather you've got it all around the dash so it makes it all totally unique to another smart say passion you're looking at all the door panels as well you can see all that really nice yellow stitching two electric windows now with this particular car you get the three spoke steering wheel with the paddle shifts at the back you've got heated seats front fog lamps and that Pioneer navigation unit stroke radio. Air conditioning all works as I mentioned, all the controls are there and then you've got the really nice funky pods um, for the rev counter and the time. Now this car has got eco stop start, you can switch that off if you don't want it to work, it's entirely up to you. So, bits I was going to point out to you, the main bit, back bumper here, you got a few, like it's a little bit of a scuff there. Now, if I took a picture from here 
at this sort of angle, you may, you may not pick it up. I want to just show it to you. We've tried to polish it out as best as we possibly can, but there's still a bit of a mark there. And it's really hard with this, uh, this matte gray color to get it all out. When I get it back, I will get the guys to have another look at it, see if they can try and get it a little bit better, but I'm not promising anything. Around the back of the car, all looks fine. Let's just open her up for you. That opens up the glass. And then you've got a handle one side here, another on the other side, and that'll open the rest of the, uh, the boot compartment. Engine is underneath that section there. At the front of the car, you've got the radiator, you've got the washer bottle, uh, and you've got the uh, water bottle for the engine coolant. Along the back of the car is all fine. Now, one thing to mention, actually, this car has got uh, last service done on the vehicle, done by the previous owner, had a full service, set of spark plugs, air filter, oil filter, and a complete set of tyres. So you've got brand new Continentals. The car's only done 2,000 miles, I think, two, 3,000 miles since its last service. So they are like a brand new. There will be pictures of that as well. Let me go round bits and pieces again. Now, with the alloy wheels, there were a couple of little scuffs on the front wheel, which I've touched up, nothing major. And there was a couple along the back wheel here. So mainly down there. Let's go round. Apologies, these videos do, I should have mentioned at the beginning, they take about eight minutes long and we're getting to just under seven minutes. So I'll try and be as brief as possible. All good round there. There were a couple of little scuffs around this one. I've touched them up round here and around there. Now I normally sort of tend to go sit down the side of the car and sort of give you give it an idea of the reflection, but because it's in matte grey, you're not going to get any reflections. Let's just show the door panels again. No kind of fraying, stitching coming apart. You've got a lockable glove box, and in there you've got like USB connectors and stuff like that. And to do with the Pioneer stereo, you've got some uh, more USB stuff and iPod connections. Let's just show the rest of the seats. Hopefully you can try and pick up the driver's seat. There's no nasty ripping, staining, fraying of any of that at all. All looks good, really. But again, she is 10 years of age, covered over 51,000 miles. So please, guys, don't expect she's going to be an absolutely brand new car. Cup holders as well. I think they were an extra. Full set of uh, normal smart mats. Got the smart logo on there. Got it on the driver's side as well couple of little chips along here I've not been able to touch them up because I haven't got that matte kind of grey colour but I just wanted to show it to you alloy wheels on the passenger side front all looks fine now a couple of little chips along the front of the car one on the wing here so I do have a similar colour to this um, and I could touch it up but it's a gloss colour uh, so if anybody does want us to get it done we will get it done for you now along the front of the car you'll see front fog lamps that was an optional extra from memory and then you've got the black grille now there was a smart badge or there would have been a smart badge in the center of that bonnet whoever has taken it off has just a couple of tiny little marks on the bonnet here now if you want us to put a smart badge on it it won't be a black one they don't make a black one they will only be uh, chrome so if you wanted us to put a uh, smart badge on there for you we can order it after you've purchased the vehicle if you want we won't put it on there because some customers may not want it and then we'll send it to you in the post and you can pop it on if you want so uh, all of our cars just to sort of finish off um, we're up to nine minutes now uh, all of our cars will come with six month warranty we try and give you as comprehensive cover as we can uh, and you can upgrade the warranty if you want to uh, but I don't want to go into that too much and take too much time on this video so if you're interested in this car or anything else we've got on Moat Park Vehicles pick up the phone send me an email text message I'll always get back to everyone as quickly as possible so I wanted to thank you again for your time and hopefully we'll speak soon take care bye bye